Hello everybody and welcome back to what might be the final part of Trover Saves the Universe. We just blew up the Mixed World, and now we're going to Glorcon's base to kill him. And save my puppies. And avenge Trover's people. Alright, you ready for this? We're gonna go in there and we're gonna do it together, partner! Alright, let's do this. It's all locked up. Well, shit. Of course we weren't gonna be able to just walk in here and... Wait, 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 hold on, hold on. Hold on, I hear something. Glorcon's true love and analyzing the eight buttholes and the seven vaginas and the seventeen rock hard penises. Uh, enough already. Buttholes, vaginas, and penises? Maybe we should, you know, keep patrolling this room. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. I, I can't stop looking at it. I just can't stop looking at it. I find myself oddly attracted to this giant mound of flesh. This guy, you gotta get serious. You can't just stand here and stare at this thing. You should probably be patrolling every square corner of this room. Alright, there we go. We're here! Where are these 17 vaginas at? From this angle of the artistic rendering, but I can see enough to make a judgment call. What do you think, partner? You you uh you attracted to that? Oh yeah, totally. Oh my god, really? <laughs> you gotta be kidding me, partner. You gotta be fucking kidding me. If I was gonna merge a bunch of worlds together and cause all this havoc, I'd need at least a hundred more rock hard diamond cutting dicks, at least ten more boobies, testicle sacks with three testicles in them, twelve more vaginas. 57 tight buttholes, a bunch of man nipples everywhere all over it, more hair on the sides. Anyways, let's get moving. Yeah, you really thought this out. A bitch. We gotta murder Glorcon and get your dogs back. We're at the end of the game. Okay, I guess we are at the end of the game. Hey, what the hell? I was listening to my music. Get out of my room. You guys shouldn't be in my room. This is my room. Uh, what can I throw what? up there? What are you talking about? Where the fuck is Glorcon? Are we on the right path? Are we heading towards Glorcon? Get the fuck out of my room! Ow, hey! Don't throw balls at me! That's not cool! You don't know what it's like to be a Glorcon clone! You don't know how hard it is out there! Oh! Right. The electricity sparks are uh, lethal! That's good for us! I was sick of listening to that! Okay, let's, let's one step closer to Glorcon and this. And Meek slitting his fucking throat open. Yeah, Trover's gonna fuck him up. Might be it. And we're gonna get your dogs back, and everything's gonna be saved, and we're gonna save the whole universe. And 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 I love you, partner. I didn't want to say that before, you know. I know that's a lot to say. I love you. It's a it's a big thing to drop on a partner. I love you, partner. Hey, Sorry, wait. you can stop oh, saying boy. it. Boy. <laughs> oh, there's the exit. Okay, we're here. Hey, Gorkon. Well, well, well. It's Trover and the Cherorpion. You dare fucking enter my chamber? My special chamber? That's right, you piece of shit. You fucking murdered everybody. You murdered my home world. I murdered all kinds of things, and I don't give a shit. I had my good reasons for You're it. You're a fucking pervert. You're a sicko. I'm not a pervert or a sicko. I'm a hopeless romantic is what I am. We're going to murder you is what you are. Unlikely. I've saved my best Glorcon clones to protect me here in my inner sanctum. Glorcon clones, attack! Oh shit! We gotta hey, kill him! Come on, partner! Hey, what the fuck? Yo! I knew I was in love. I couldn't stop obsessing about that path of the future. I knew the only way that it would come into existence is if I manifested it by breaking free from the abstainers, merging worlds, bringing life to my true love, my giant. 12 buttholed, 7 vagina, beautiful flesh beast of love. Of love. Hey, what the fuck is wrong, man? Something's fuck wrong with them. you! You destroyed both of our whole worlds! You fucking fucked it all up by destroying the Oh, he just killed him. Now I have to find other planets and merge them together. 
together. It's gonna cost my true love at least two bottles. That's fine, my true love will be a little bit different. But at least my true love will still have all those diamond hard penises. All 18 of them. Diamond hard, rock hard penises. Always hard. Never get soft. Actual bones inside of them. That's why I'm merging these worlds in a specific way that I am. Because once these worlds are merged, and those worlds are merged, then I'm gonna get some life from those worlds. Cross-pollinate it with life from these worlds. And then merge a couple of more worlds. And before you know it, one, two, three, my true love is here. And my true love is ready to go. Ready to support me. Ready to care about me. Ready to love me. In a wholesome and comforting way that I've never felt. And also, those 18 rock-hard penises and 13 vaginas. Who's going to turn their nose up at that? That's just the icing on the cake. Because my true love is thoughtful, deep, affectionate. Pink skin and knows how to move those hips. All 15 of them. And also consistently wet and dry in the places that you'd like them to. Like on the balls. Like on the balls. You realize you've murdered countless millions of. of, of what the fuck? Why are the, why are the pylon shields off? Glorcon clone. What's going on? Glorcon, we don't know. We're working on it. We, we, we're not sure what happened. There's been some sort of electrical surge. Oh. Sit, you fucking okay. dumb dumb. Can I get this one? Oh, okay, we're gonna kill these ones. Oh, this is like the final stages. How do I get up there? Um. This is this 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 chamber is so much more difficult than the first chamber. Okay. This is my fallback safety chamber in case of emergency. And now you're fucked because I've got extra more difficult floor on And there's no fucking way you're gonna be able to take out the shield, my pylons that power my fucking protective shield that protects me, and you're fucking dead. Now, I'd like to talk a little bit more about my one true love. Go ahead. Uh, partner, there's gotta be a way to do this. I swear to God, I, I, I have a feeling it's sort of building on what we just did in that last room. There's gotta be another one or two of those fucking power orbs in here. Fuck you, you little shitbags. There's no fucking power orbs. And Glorcon clones, I swear to God, if anyone accidentally drops a power orb in here, I will, I will have you personally executed. You don't keep power orbs in the power orb section of the castle. You understand? I understand. You're not power I want to kill this guy first. I mean, I'm can I'm in control of Trover. Do you not know that? Since you guys are here and you're about to die, there's no reason for me to be all angry. I mean, I'm about to get what I want, so I'm gonna I'm gonna just talk to you like I would talk to. Do I have to do this all at once? I hang out with in between working on. Oh, probably one for each side. Assistance of my one true love, and you know some of the stuff we talk about is like uh, you guys ever you guys ever heard of Clonefell? Clonefell. I, I, I actually cloned some Lord of the Rings. I said, go go start it. There's a whole wing to this castle. Go start a studio, green screen, you know, build sets, and make me some TV. One of the first things they did was clone Feld. I am getting sued up my ass right now for clone Feld by another. Why do you idiots keep dropping these orbs into the pipes? Keep dropping the orbs. You can't Turn the pipes off. Don't use them at all. These are the best clones why do you ever. Even have this system. I'm really sorry, Clorcon. Uh, uh, I deeply apologize. I don't know what happened there. Shut the fuck up, fucking idiots. Uh, I'm. I'm just gonna clear my head. I'm behind my protective shield. I'm safe. I'm gonna oh, kill these idiots. Shit. It's absurd that we even, even let them come this far. I just want to think about my one true love. That kind of sounds like me. Oh, my one true love. What we will do together. We're going to go to the beach. The crazy alien beach resort. They're going to have a giant blanket. I'm going to make sure of it. Giant terry cloth towel. We're going to lay it on the beach. We'll back the truck up and unload my one true love. Make 
sure the truck is nice and greased up so my one true love slips right out as the truck lifts up and dumps my one true love onto the massive terry clock towel that we have oh, and then that's when we'll order our drinks and we'll cheers nope. them and we'll have a giant umbrella, yes, we keep dropping umbrella these. and and we'll just talk about the future how many kids do you want to have oh i don't know how many kids do you want to have is the sand bothering you right now babe yes it is sweetie i'll lick it off and then i'll lick the sand off oh god it's actually everywhere but why does it taste like sugar why does it taste so delicious and why am i swallowing it all because we're on the beaches of glucosius with the sugariest sand of any world and by the way what guess where that Come world on. came from me i created it by merging a bunch of worlds together there we go whoa whoa whoa, whoa. what the fuck what the fuck god damn it no you've got to be fucking kidding me fucking glock on clothes fuck up you your fucking game what the fuck Oh, nice. Got him in the butt. Where, where's Trover at? Oh, there he is. Last boss or last area? Holy shit, partner! We're getting to him. Holy shit, partner! We're we're, we're doing. No, oh, there's the thing. <laughs> now you're really fucked. This is my most treacherous chain. We're trying to collect there, my dogs. Partner, we gotta lay into Glorcon. Now's our chance. We gotta hit him. Boy, you know, I never thought I'd be this good. calm watching the two of you. Ugh, son of a bitch. <laughs> hey, I got one of my dogs. No, no. He was a good boy. Partner, we're doing it. We're doing it. Uh, get the other one. No, no. You've got to be fucking Chin Chin or whatever the other one's called. I'm supposed to get this far. The toughest Glorcon clones I've ever made. I saved them for this room. Get him. Their hit points are out of control. It's fucking crazy. The level of difficulty is wild in here. Can't really see because I can't go up. Thank you. <laughs> no more orbs. Oh, what? That's it. You have enough with this fucking Glorcon clone incompetence. You're all dead. What was that? If I see a fucking Glorcon clone into this room, I will fucking personally oh, Trover's down. kill them myself. As for you, purple eye hole monster. Where'd the ball go? If you want something done right, you gotta do it your fucking self. Uh. Oh! No, Trover! How about that, Chair Orpian? Holy shit. Idiot. Now your little purple friend is dead. Rip his fucking head off. Look at your partner. I want you to... Oh, <laughs> ow, fuck. God damn it. Oh, fucking hurt. Son of a bitch, I fucking hurt. Ah. All right, we can do this. Anyway, where was I? And I don't fucking need to sit here. I'm sorry, Trover. I'll make sure your, you your body gets the work done. That's one. No, no, ah, fuck, ah, ah, fucking abstainers, ah, god damn it. Don't throw that other crystal baby in my eye. You don't know what it'll do. You don't know what's gonna happen. You don't know what it'll do if you reunite it. No, there we go. No, this isn't supposed to happen. My one true love. No, all the dicks and buttholes. Oh, ah, 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 
Oh, can I please see what the sticks and bottles lady? Man, Trover. He predicted what's gonna happen. He's gonna rip my head off. Fuck. He got fucked up. On tonight's broadcast, love, happiness, and euphoria. Chills of absolute pure bliss running down your body. That's on tonight's forecast for today. You're watching the All the Time channel. This is the All the Time show. Oh, ah. Uh, you feel that euphoric feeling? Oh, ah. Uh, we're all united. We're all connected. We're all one. Oh, at least I got my dogs. Mm, oh, man. Oh, Job. Oh. It feels oh, like an orgasm. Man, I'm feeling it all up and down my little baby spine. Oh, oh, Jeff. Oh, all right. We're going to go to test pattern for a little bit. This is Jeff. I gotta, listen, who cares? You know, everything's cool. We're going to go to test pattern. We'll come back in a little bit. Okay. Hello. Partner, Trover. It's, me. it's Trover. Oh my God! You have no idea what's going on. I mean, holy crap! I, I let me tell you something. I feel like a gazillion bucks right now. Gazillion. My whole body's all tingly. I feel all euphoric and oh God! You feel that? There's your little pup pup guys. You're reunited with them. Wait, where are we? I love we? you. We're all together, man. Here, I'll let the boss tell you. He's right outside. Come on. Come out are we here. in like heaven or something? Oh, okay. Something. I'm cool. I'm Trover. What? Oh, Cherorpian. Oh my god. Are we in heaven? So good. Everyone's dead, the entire universe. Oh jeez. You killed everyone, but it's great because everyone's here, everyone's happy. This, it, this place it just feels good to be here. Everyone's united. We're all on the same page. There's no more fighting or any trouble. And it's and we're all in this weird afterlife world and we're we're, we're united together and it's wonderful. Come, come when you get a second, come out here and come say hi. Come out into this cloudy wonderland of joy and come talk to everybody. Glorcon's even here. Oh really? Everyone's here. What? It's great. Let's go say hi to Glorcon. the best ending of any video game uh, I've ever seen. Uh, yeah, you have fun there, boss man. <laughs> 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 uh, 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 there's never been a better ending. Uh, 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 this is a Metacritic 10 out of 10. Uh, what does this get on Metacritic? Uh, Metacritic? I'll look it up after. Uh, Fucking game breaker. Uh, we're a goddamn game breaker. Uh, 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 why do I suddenly sound like the evil villain of the game? Uh, uh, it's because I'm so euphoric. Uh, uh, okay, you have fun with that. I, I can't believe how beautiful this place oh, is. Oh, shit. Uh, 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 oh, is that you? You see how beautiful it is? Oh, man. Oh, I'm lucky I got here a little bit before you. Uh, Hey, it's this guy. Oh, hey, it's you too. Remember me? You killed me at the beginning? Oh, yeah, I remember. I was the first person here. Thanks to you, I made it just in time for the Afterlife Early Bird special. Two eggs, two strips of bacon, toast, and an over-the-pants hand job by a blind milkman. <laughs> to be honest, the eggs were a little cold, and my beef baton feels like it's been rubbing up against an office carpet for the better part of the day, but who cares? I just fucking love it here. It's so awesome, and it's euphoric and nice, and oh, I'm just gonna shit right here. Ah! <sighs> Alright, well, you're welcome. It's the fat guy up there. Get it all out. I love it here. 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 It's so euphoric and nice. Oh. So if you didn't oh, kill these guys, would they still be here? Because the entire cosmos exploded anyway. Oh, wow. You're going to love it here. You're going to love living with me. You're gonna love living with me now. Ah, oh, oh, sometimes it's hot. Okay, let's just go. Oh, ah, oh, oh. Huh? oh it's credits. Justin Rowan, Chief Creative Officer. Is that what he looks like? <laughs> 
Tanya Watson, Chief Executive Officer. Well, her, her drawing looks nice. Hey, guys. Uh, abstainers, how's it going? Hey, Clark how's on. it going, you guys? Oh, I feel like such a bonehead. I am so dumb. I can't even, I can't believe what I was up to. Oh, boy, you know, being killed and elevated to this incredible afterlife world where I'm sh I shed all of my earthly desires and, and things. I now see that I was just acting like a lunatic and all of my motivation was absurd and I, I was all just crazy. Now, now I, I can see that now very clearly and I just want to apologize to you guys. I'm so sorry. I apologize. Yes, we are united again, the abstainers, and we, we're just going to abstain and chill here and we all feel very good and excited and we're happy to be reunited with Glorcon and we're happy to be a one, you know, whatever. We're, we're, we're all happy as hell. This place is great. Yes, we're happy as hell. We're here and we're just hanging out and I'm so sorry. God, I feel like a do dummy. I feel like a bonehead, a, a real robozo. But, uh, but, you know, I, I also feel very euphoric and united with everything and super happy and content and complete and whole. And I've never felt that way, and I just feel that. Oh, it's all I feel, coursing through my blood. Yes, it's true. It is coursing through my blood as well. Why are you humping? I wish we could have come here earlier. It's incredible. I'm so happy. You know, I, I always wondered, wh wh why is your guys' voices always changing? You know, what's going on? It's because, Trover, we're always going through puberty. <laughs> That's right, Trover. We are going through puberty all the time. Uh, oh, I uh, get it. Oh, you, you, you guys are, like, cosmically shackled to... The confines of puberty experiencing all the time, huh? Oh, Trover, if you only knew. Oh, it's that person. Oh, oh, how difficult it was to oh, always experience puberty. Yes, Trover. Oh, oh. That is one of the reasons why oh, <laughs> I wanted to break free and do all the bullshit I did that oh, causes all the shit that I caused. And I feel really dumb about it. And boy, do am I a stupid dummy. And boy, am I clear-headed now. That's right, Trover. I'm the other abstainer talking. We are all constantly going through the throes of puberty, backwards, forwards, up, down, <laughs> left, right, A, B, A, B, select, start, you name it. It's always going on. I don't think you need the select in that. I think it's just start. Uh, Trover, don't tell me what I know about stuff. You little son of a bitch. <laughs> uh, oh, I feel so good. I, I can't even be mad. I tried to be mad, and I couldn't even be mad. You know what I mean, other abstainer? Yes, I know exactly what you mean, my friend. Oh, oh, this, oh, oh, my little jingles are dancing. Oh, my jingles are dancing, you know? Oh, you guys, are you guys just jingles dancing? Oh, yeah, my jingles are dancing. Oh, yes, oh. My, in fact, my jingles are dancing, too. I feel a little bit out of the loop on this <laughs> whole jingles dancing thing. As you should, Trover. When our jingles dance, that means that we're very happy. <laughs> Hold on. That <laughs> yes, Trover, that means that we are so happy when our little jingles are dancing and just shaking about and pulsating. Is your jingle pulsating? Yes, my jingle is pulsating. My jingles, my... There's two of them. Yes, of course, there's when, two of them. When that guy, like, oh, broke there, also was that, like, a real thing? It sounded like people in the background when they were doing the VA guys. were just laughing. Oh, man. Did I fuck up? Oh, I, I love that you forgive me. Yes, we forgive you. And we also have very greasy, pulsating jingles. Oh, and they're sweating and greasy. That's right. Mine are greasy and sweaty, and they're filling a bucket between my legs down below the clouds. There's a bucket below the clouds. And all my little jingles are sweating and dripping into the bucket. <laughs> oh, you guys. Oh. Okay, they're gonna go back to doing that. Uh, which way should I go? I can go left or right. Looks like there's more if I go that way, so let's go this way first. Oh, I can hear the jingles. Why do you keep doing this to I want oh, man, this afterlife world. Oh, where'd you go? Did I accidentally kill you? It feels so good, you know? Oh. G. Day Craig, Liarist. Desmond Rogers. Me a worm. Oh, this guy again. I want a little grub worm, and I want it now. It's coming out of the ground. Did you see him? He's right there. Oh. Let me go up here first. Hey, I'm Tony. Man, oh, hey, guys. Here. It's awesome up here. Tony. You guys are the best. This place is amazing. I feel like I'm coming. 
I'm with my brother now. We're reunited. Me and Downgrade Donnie together again. This afterlife zone is so awesome. It feels great to be with my bros and my sis. This place is Who's that guy? the fucking best. It's like having a boner and pooping at the same time, like kind of like a blumpkin. It's fucking amazing. And everyone's here, like Tony's here, and Teddy, and Donnie, and even Schweppy's here. I mean, can you believe that? Hey, get out of here. Oh, hey. Did you ever <laughs> meet him? He gives you the sticky chair upgrade. Ah, mm, ah, I make everything sticky. I haven't seen Schweppy in forever. Well, anyway, we just love it up here. Everything feels so good and euphoric. It just feels so nice. Like, uh. Oh. 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 Shreppy's getting into it. Okay, they seem busy. Uh, that seems like the end. Like, you go back there at the end. I can't go up to that guy, so I'll just go back down here. Hey, dude. Oh, hey. Look who it is. The two people that I love most. <laughs> oh, I can collect babies here? You kill me. Thank you so much for sending me to this incredible place. I love it, and I love you. I love both of you so very much. I want to make love to you both. <laughs> I want to strip the sheets off a mattress and stain that bad boy up with our love. Ooh, we I just love this place. Mm, mm. I love you guys. That's just the wet TV now. So, anyways, <laughs> oh, oh, yeah, you get back oh, to that. Oh, 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 yeah, here we go. I love you. Oh, I love y'all. Oh, my, here, we, here it is. Oh, you feel it? Huh? You like it, huh? Oh, oh, this place is amazing. Oh, 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 wait. Oh, you guys feel that? Oh, oh, oh. That guy just come. Whoa, this place is amazing. Oh my goodness. What? Damn. <laughs> that was. Oh my goodness, instantaneously. It happened. Oh, I'm, I'm kind of lost the words, but my body feels so good. Oh, 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 oh. this place is amazing, guys. Wow. Oh, 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 wait. Oh, you guys feel Okay, he's just gonna oh, keep ejaculating. Let's just keep going on. Uh, Brent Kennedy, junior animator. John Boachman, senior animator. David Gardner, senior animator. Okay, oh, Mike, and uh, pop up. Pop up. Just the two people we were looking for. We have a question to ask you two, but before we do, I just want to say thank you. Thank you for pushing me and a dozen living lunch boxes off of a cliff. That lucky son of a oh, these pre power babies. Who I've they make my brain shiver. Before me. We just love it here. It's the best. And it turns out you can have sex with just about anything and it'll get pregnant, which means Mr. Pop Up and I are having a baby. Congrats. We had sex. That's How's that right. possible? We had sex in every imaginable position that you could think of. We're just so excited and happy to become parents. Oh, and this place feels so nice and euphoric. Oh, pop up. I feel another wave coming on. Get in Damn. here. Damn. You got a green power, baby. Okay, well, they're going to have fun. <laughs> okay. Okay, you're leaving? Yeah, it okay, feels good ya. here. Love it. Oh, Who are these yeah. guys? Oh, are they the guys that are like looking at each other's balls? Hey, what? what's going on? Hey, hey, Chair Orpian. What's up, uh, 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 purple guy? Hey, listen, man, we feel really good. We're really sorry. Yeah, we're the clones that were up on the wall in that one level that were giving you giving you trouble. Oh, I remember. Yeah, the, the, the level with the cauldron. Yeah, that's right. We're we're really sorry. We 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 were real bad. We were real bad pieces of shit to you guys, and that's not cool. And we feel super euphoric and high now and yeah i feel like i just took a whip it hey easy easy i don't know what he means by that but yeah we feel great we feel good so where are all the other clones then 
hanging out, sort of kind of trippy, similar to sort of the situation where we first met you guys, you know what I mean? It's kind of crazy. Yeah, it's really crazy. Hey, can I just jump in real quick? I want to say, uh, I'm, a, I'm, I'm, I feel so fucking euphoric and like, uh, like I'm on You're having drugs. a field day with the word and euphoric. I'm not trying to be pro-drug or like trying to say you should do drugs or anything. But maybe when you die, this is what it feels like. You know what I mean? Well, hold on, dude. Are you... Does that mean you're pro-death? Are you trying to say, like, you <laughs> commit suicide? No, no, no. God. If people commit suicide because of this game, that would be really horrible. I, that's not my intentions at all. I'm just saying that in this particular section of the game, this fictional video game, I feel incredibly euphoric and amazing. Yeah, me too. I feel super euphoric and amazing, but but dude, you are talking about pro drug stuff and pro like suicide stuff. So that's not cool. So we got to get our story straight here. That's not good. No, listen, I don't I didn't mean that wasn't my intention. It's not I agree. No anyone who's playing this game, you should not commit suicide and you should not do drugs because that would not create the same effect that we're feeling in this incredible afterlife area. Yeah, that's a good way to put it. Yeah. Uh, let me let me reiterate this. You cannot do drugs or kill yourself at all under any circumstances. By playing this game, you agree you will not do drugs or kill yourself under any circumstances. And uh, because if you did, it wouldn't be the same as what we feel right now in this crazy afterlife area. And we are so high. Man, I'm so high. Oh, my God. Oh. Well, I do agree with that. Oh, that? I do want to see what happens when they, if I say no. I feel it. Oh, my God. Oh, oh. Oh, I feel it. Totally feel it. Oh, oh, oh. yeah. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, just, just let it. Just let it. Just let it take over. Just let it. Just, just lean into it. Oh, oh. Oh, yeah. I'm leaning into it. Oh, oh, oh. oh. Okay, we should probably get going. Uh. Welcome back. Where were we? Oh, I know. Are they just waiting for me to come back? Who's that? Oh, that guy. Spencer McKern, writer. Anthony Bosco, narrative editor. Or narrative editor, yep. Okay, that guy's... Just... Oh, God. Oh, hey, guys, how's it going? Oh, what? Hey, you know, we tried to see your show the other night, but instead you walked in on a murder scene? Murder? But uh, we thought you killed yourself. Yeah, and so did the police. It was foul play, Trover, that involved insider trading. <laughs> I was going to say, where did the rope coming from? Wet hobo oatmeal disco fights. Five old Asian senators peeing in a baby pool, laundering couch change, murder, a dairy farmer feeding a pickle to a blind dog, and the list goes on. Oh my god! But now I'm here, and I couldn't be happier. I have sold out crowds every night with zero hecklers. But you know what the best part about this place is? My wife's name isn't on the guest list. <laughs> hey oh! Hey oh! Applause. What I'm talking about. When she first arrived, the doorman asked her, "If you're here, then who's running hell? Am I right?" <laughs> thank you, thank you. Oh, you're too kind, too kind. You know, my wife came up to me the other day and asked if I could describe her in two words. I said, "Easy, fire and brimstone." <laughs> morning when I wake up, I turn to my wife and I whisper the three little words that every woman loves to hear. Devil be gone! <laughs> there are all the jokes about your wife and you hate her? Nothing. Man, who died? Besides us. <laughs> oh, I'm just kidding about my wife, by the way. I love her very much. Her family, on the other hand, well, that's a different story. She's got four siblings. Conquest, war, famine, and death. Out of the four, I choose death. Come on, give me a break, huh? Whoopity wow! <laughs> get his eyes. Jeez, oh, Peach, is this thing on? I is this thing even on? Hello, is this thing on? All right, he's just <laughs> gonna keep Woo. making jokes about his yeah, wife. I'm on a roll, baby. Oh yeah, I'm on fire. All right, let's keep this comedy train going. Chug a chug. Oh, oh, hey, you're Man, leaving. I can't. This, Boy, is, this is amazing. Martin like, Switzer, this, senior programmer. I, I feel a little high. Like Nick I'm Weiss, on some sort of drug. Kevin Layout, programmer. Peddling, 
uh, to the masses right now. Oh, it's scale. And boy, it's just, it's great. I feel wonderful and euphoric and great, you know, and I feel connected to everybody. Trover. The same with Gale. Oh, hey, what's up, Gale? Listen, Trover, I, I need to tell you, I feel like a real piece of shit now that I'm feeling all this euphoria just stroking my body up and down. Like it, if my, if, as if for my body were a giant <laughs> penis or labia. I don't care that you left me hanging with last month's rent and seven hundred and twenty dollars, including the cleaning deposit. And I don't care that you stole my crystal babies and killed my roommate. Okay, Gail. And He's I right up there. I don't care that you knowingly fucked Shrinkle when you thought it was a dinkle. <laughs> and I don't care that you peed in the sink on purpose. All right, Gail. And I don't care that you never have worn a hat. And I've lost all upsetness. About that you shit in my mouth when I slept and I don't I'm not even upset or worried that you don't close the shower curtain while you showered and I don't care that I walked in on you while you were jerking off to judge brown crinkle what G my Gale, favorite sorry, show what? guilty pleasure and I don't mind that you made an amateur instructive dance video in our living room and I feel bad that I was upset about the fact that you wrote a romance novel entitled A Dame to Dingle With under the pen name Shudder B. Shrungle. I don't even care that you are chairist. What? Because no. fuck chair people. But also, I love them because I feel all this euphoric feelings. And I don't care that you stole all my journals and ruined them in your greasy little fingers. And I don't even mind that you wouldn't eat all the turkey. And I don't care that you have one tiny internal testicle anymore. I don't mind true? that. And I don't mind at all that you pooped on the floor in front of my friends. And I don't mind even in the slightest right now that you used to guilt me about loudly rubbing my little slonger against random things in the house. And I especially don't even care that you pissed on the poster that terrified me. And I don't mind that you ruined my zoo and my little cube TVs that I created to fly around and I only had a few of them and you killed and broken them all. I don't mind of any of these things anymore because I'm in this beautiful, amazing afterlife land that you you and your Cherorpian person created for me. And oh my God, Trover, if I could only go back in time, I would change it all. And I would fix all the horrible things I've done wrong to you. Uh, 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 okay, he's just gonna be doing that. <laughs> What's uh, down here? Oh, Jesus. Hey, you two. It's me, remember? Doopy Dooper. Still hate you. I'm really glad that you killed me earlier because I've been here for a while now. <laughs> I am so enjoying this afterlife zone place. Dang, I've been hanging out with all my friends and life is great. I love it here. They've got all my favorite shows on demand and they never stop oh, making new spawns. episodes. This is so great. It just makes oh. me all tingly inside. Ugh, all tingly. Holy shit, it's a great uh, power baby. Damn it. Okay, well, let's just leave her, because still fuck her. More credits. Hey, uh, Are there is any? Like, this is too good to be true. You know, there's got to be yeah, uh... some kind of weird something's up. You know, it's like, this is too crazy to feel oh. this good. Uh, and like, uh, maybe there's some kind of... Maybe they don't mind that I killed them. do with this weird afterlife world, and maybe it's too good to be true or something. Uh, uh, you know, maybe we're teeing up a sequel <laughs> story arc, you know? Uh, if we sell enough copies of this, maybe we can make it. I don't know. I mean, uh, uh, who am I? I'm just the main character and all. Just the character they named the game after. Oh, hey, it's you guys. Oh, man, let me tell you something. I am so clear-headed and happy in this crazy afterlife world i can't even tell you about it you know thank god you killed the villagers what good bad indifferent wrong villagers right villagers doesn't Green even matter power, baby, you brought them hole. here they were they've been here hanging out they're great they love it here they've been here longer than me this god, place can i kill these ones I'm, the, I'm voodoo person my name's voodoo person I, thank god you killed the villagers because they're all here <laughs> they've been fucked here up you can kill them this again afterlife world is so good what are you sitting on? Sports boys? 
Okay, but he's gonna be doing that. I think that's everything. Some more credits. All right. Yeah, I think that's everything. Back to these guys. Oh, you guys. Oh, they're going back to that. I don't know why I can't talk to that guy. What worm? Why are you taking so long? Why are you doing this with your life? What are you doing with your life? Does he get bigger? All right, you're welcome. You know, you're in heaven. You'd think you'd be able to, like, you know, get your own. They're back to this. All right, what's in there? Oh, hey, look, Cherorpian, partner. It's, 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 we got a telepod. There's a telepod here. Holy crap. Partner, seriously, listen. If we go back to the levels we didn't collect all the power babies in and get the rest of the ones we didn't get, yeah, sure, we have to re-experience the level exactly as it was experienced before. And yeah, sure, it was a big fucking bunch of bullshit. <laughs> but we will get a chance to collect all the green power babies, and there's all these amazing unlocks that it gives us. It I mean, just gives you health, right? Yeah, shit we unlock. A whole bunch of shit. I mean, come on, let's do it. Are you saying something Parker, else? If you're trying to collect them all, look a little harder. There's a lot more out there. You know there's a bunch of power babies still out there. You know I'm gonna give a really cool prize if you get them all right. We better say something else about the pod. Okay, well, Trover, let's go. <laughs> all right, and that was Trover saves the universe, even though the universe fucking exploded or whatever. Oh man. All right. No uh, real credits. It was just like, are those really all the people that worked on this game? It was like less than 20. Okay, well, I had fun playing this game. Uh, you know, let's just rate it because that basically sums up all I have to say anyway. Uh, if you don't know, I rate games out of 10 points based on five categories consisting of two points. We got design, gameplay, story, was it worth the money and funness. So first up design. With design, I usually group up like character design, graphics, and that shit. I'll say the graphics, they were good for what they were going for, alright? It was like the cartoony, Rick and Morty kind of shit. The design was the Rick and Morty kind. Uh, it's just fucking weird ass shit. Some funny stuff, and uh, yeah, yeah design, yeah, let's go with that too. The gameplay. Uh, the gameplay. I mean, it wasn't, the game wasn't meant, or like the main purpose of the game wasn't for gameplay, it was like for the comedy aspect, and then like of course they gotta add like the, the combat system, and then like the traverse, and they gave you upgrades, but like it was just, you know, fight, and then move on, then fight, and then move on, and then more fighting, so gameplay, let's just go with a one. I was saying it's a bad gameplay, it just wasn't the best. And the story... <laughs> story, I'm just gonna give a two right away. <laughs> Fucking the dialogue, the characters... The writing... The story that I get, The story... If I can... Summarize it... A powerful being kidnaps two dogs to get powers to merge worlds together in order to get his one true love. You put that on paper, people will be like, what the fuck are you talking about? But it works. Yeah, story two. Was it worth the money? When I bought it, it was 20 bucks, but I think you can buy it for like 30. So... I think it was 30 when it came out. Uh, I don't know if like the price got knocked down. I'd say, yeah, it was definitely worth it. It's like a five-hour game, but it's just so hilarious. And, uh, the funness. Of course, I had fun playing it. Well, I was boring some parts, just killing people. Just, like, listening to, like, all the dialogue in the background of, like, the two guys on the wall or the Glorcon at the end. <laughs> I 
I had real fun playing it, so I'll give that a two. And so if my math is right, which probably isn't, but it should be, we got a nine out of 10 game. Good game, very good game. All right, and that's gonna do it for Trover Saves the Universe. Uh, I think I'm out of games right now. I don't have anything in the vault. No, there are no recordings or anything, nope. In the next series, I will see you when we are starting The Last of Us. Remastered, I think. Was it remastered for PS4? I don't know. The one on PS4. Uh, sequel's supposed to come out at some point, so I might as well get that game underway because I never played it before. I do know what happens, so I've seen gameplays of it. So I'll see you all then. In the meantime, thank you all for watching. Be sure to down below, leave a like, subscribe, share, and I'll see you in that. Goodbye.